Picking up my dog, putting up my dog, picking up my dog, putting up my dog, picking up my dog, putting up my dog, picking up a dog, putting up a dog. So TK, TK said that this is a good thing. I guess. Cool. All right. Well, that oh, seems sufficient. God, no, my water in your dog, water in your dog. Water in my dog, water in my dog. <laughs> your daily water watering of the water. floor. Of it's taking a bath, a little shower. A little shower. So, uh, don't hoe your dog, please. Whoa. That's listen, bad news. That's not in the cards. So, oh. Oh, are your tourneys done? Yeah. Dude, so I think you might be able to throw a turnip over the fence. What fence? That fence right there. I think if you face... Yeah! Oh! All right. Yeah, dude, saving time. Saving frames, dude. We're speed running it. <laughs> Pick up my turnip. Throwing down my turnip. Picking up my turnip. Throwing down my turnip. So this the, is uh, uh, this is a new day. New day in Harvest Moon. We're gonna get some cash. Hopefully get some chickens out of it. Out of the, the deal. That's the idea. At least one. At least one. And then uh, go into... Uh, go into I think my, Ellen, my I think Ellen also likes turnips. So do you want to save one or do you want to give her just the middle one again? Um, uh, well, I'm gonna give her both the middle ones. But I am gonna give her this one right here. Nice, dude. I think she likes turnips. I'm pretty sure if she, she likes doesn't. Turnips. And I go down to one heart because of you and your. It wouldn't happen. It wouldn't your happen. lackadaisical. It wouldn't happen. Was a fair attitude towards this whole wooing process. It wouldn't. It wouldn't happen. Mister committed relationship. My. La <laughs> Thank you. It looks delicious. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude! Delicious turnips. I love them. Mr. You look pretty busy. You look pretty busy. I'm not busy. I'm not busy. I oh, I should probably. Do I have enough money for a chicken? Do it. Do, I have do you? I think you have only eight hundred or nine fifty. What do you want today? Buy a chicken. Buy a chicken. How much money's? Oh, you do buy it. You need more grass. Go cut down your grass. Go cut down your grass. Okay. I forgot. I forgot. You need to feed them. That's probably gonna be. Uh... A couple more days, I think. You may need to buy more grass, actually. How much? I would do that now, since you're gonna get a shit ton of turnip money. Yep. I don't and know how much a shit ton is. I actually don't know how much turnip money you're gonna get. We're gonna buy. But some. you might want to buy a couple more patches of grass, and then maybe some more turnips and potatoes. But then that might push off your. Five hundred G's, dude. Oh, fuck. You only have nine slot spots, though. You might just want to suck it up and buy that grass, and then just like make up that money. I wonder if the turnips will give me that. The that turnips amount. are going to give you at least five. For the chicken. Oh, yeah, at least enough for the chicken. All right. That's what we'll do. I just don't know if you're going to have enough grass yet. The, uh, we'll find out. I'm going to hoe my way down. <laughs> going to hoe your way down. All right. So, we are going to start. Nice. The grass. Even further. I wonder, is that gra does that grass oh, look Corey. ready? Does that grass look ready to... To I think so. Cut down? I can never tell. Well, I mean, there's only one way to find out, right? There is. Oh, oh, that mole! Get that mole! How do I... Take him, take him, pick him up. And get... I don't know, can you water? take him out of the... Can you, I don't think you drown him, no. Can you take him out, out of the farm? What does he do? And, like, put him down? There you go. Nice, <clears throat> go home, little mole. Well, he was home, and then I... Go back to the... to the... nature. Nine hundred! Nine hundred, right, dude! Killer! Good. Need more grass my coffee, for my livestock. My coffee's Are you hot, kidding Roger. Me? I got grass for you. I got grass. I'll show you grass right here. What if, oh. what if they made a Harvest Moon, like the new Harvest Moon, to where you could actually, like, uh... run, like, a dispensary or something, or, like, a marijuana... <laughs> Like grow facility, that'd be interesting. That would be hilarious. like a like there is that you said that there was one with a greenhouse in it. I think that that yeah, really sixty four has a greenhouse in it. Yeah. If if you could do like greenhouse, you could do like that type of of like uh, like drugs. Well, not like drugs specifically, but but like, like oregano. I think it'd be <laughs> yeah, but like, like I think that it's shit? interesting that you could grow things, different plants in different types of environments. Yeah, you know so. Do, 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 do. So. Yeah. Well, and I mean, this game has like. So what the greenhouse does is right. it is it basically circumvents. You only bought one bag, didn't you? Oh yeah. You Why not do bag. more? I don't know. Try and I, get your sickle and harvest that grass if you. Do I need uh, you to water it too? Yeah. 
No, you don't need to. You don't water grass, but you need to water those guys. What my tater? What my turn up? What my tater? What my turn up? <laughs> that suggested. Um, but I think the greenhouse really circumvents the seasons thing because, uh, and the fact that you can like when you have the greenhouse, you can do all your harvesting indoors. Uh, watering my sickle. So time doesn't pass while you're indoors, and so you can do all of your farming stuff, like your cows and chickens and your veggies. Are so you can just inside. fill the entire field with That's food. That's why you like that game, dude. It's so good. Yes, cut it up. And I should be able with this. I Stick should be it able in the to, silo. To uh, you think you can get a chicken with nine grass? Yeah, I think so. I mean, I have some food for it. You know. Yep. I don't. I don't. I honestly do not remember how much it requires you to have. I think it just requires you to have some sort of food. Have something in there. Yeah. What's the uh? What's what's your horoscope for today? So yeah, 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 yeah. It's a great song. Weird Al Yankovic. That was my first rock and roll show. Weird Al? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it was really funny. I it have started... yet to see Weird Al live, but that sounds like it would be a hell of a show. It me? was great. He like, uh, it was right when <clears throat> that episode one song just came out. Like, yeah, this here Anakin guy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, tater for my. You're sweet. I was trying tater to tater for your Ellen. For my, uh, for my uh... tater for your. I was trying to rhyme it. Skater. Tater for your hater, dude. Tater for my, uh... Oh, nice. You can jump that little fancy. Do it. Thank, Thank you. you. It, looks, it delicious. looks delicious. Oh! Well, I'll I taste will. your cake when it's baked. Listen, you need to stop getting your... I was just saying I'll taste the cake when it's baked. Oh, it's Sunday. I enjoy cake, Roger. Um... You know that. Fuck. Although I do like pie more, I think. I will save cake and pie. I, it I think pie on takes what, the cake too. What type of pie and what type of cake? That's true. My favorite pie, dude, is like a. Uh, my mom used to make it cherry o cream pie. Yeah. It's like a. It's like a cream cheese filling with. Uh, wow. Dude, it's a cream cheese filling, with like a a, a can of of cherry pie filling on top. So, why are they closed? Is Why isn't she in church? Oh, dude, it's not. It might not be Sunday. I think they're closed like Tuesday, Thursday, or something oh, like what? that. Oh, what? Check the press your pause menu. It might show you. No. Oh, okay. Just live dangerously. Saturday. Oh, also, go to the church real quick. I will. <clears throat> go to the churchy church. Eat that croissant. So, I already gave Ellen her thing. Crops aren't Ellen gonna. Thing. Don't eat any crop Crops things. Crops are done. Go, go into the church. Into the. Here's the church. Here's the steeple. Open it up, and there's all the people. Oh, then, there's the there's, there's the witch the, lady. The, the midwife. You better listen to the old preacher. Um, do, there's a book up there. The Bible. Read that. No, no. Read that book. Events of the year, dude. These are where you find. Ah, there this we is go. Where you find there we out go. We were about all the stuff. First spring, First of spring month. New Year's, New Year's festival. festival. 23rd of spring. So that's flower festival. That's coming up. Uh, not really that soon. Well, it's, it's somewhat soon. Because we're in festival. the first spring right now, right? We're in the first spring, yeah. 20th is the Egg Festival. Autumn's got some good festivals. Uh, Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving Festival. Uh, Star Night Festival. festival. Yeah. So, oh, whoops. <laughs> as I um, raise my sickle in this church. As I raise my watering can. So, 10 more days. 10 more days. We got it. Oh, look at, look at those Gs. 1510, dude. You're, you're, I wonder, uh, can I play the organ? Cruising. No. It's a very old it's organ. It's a very old organ. All right. <clears throat> Mm, Dude, I've noticed since we've I've noticed in the past couple of weeks I haven't been drinking coffee while we've been recording. Yeah, I don't. I, I, How do you feel about? I that? missed it, dude. I like. It's also we, because I stopped drinking coffee that I that feel like be, it probably has. That might a, be true as well. Not saying that you are totally. Your my coffee drinking dictating. is dependent on you. No, no. but or like, yeah, actions. when you'd come over and be like, "Hey, you want some coffee?" I'd be like, "Yeah, I'll have a coffee too." Yeah, and I would make coffee for you. Yeah, dude. Yeah. The, uh... With the Keurig. With the Keurig. Yeah. Drinking tea, though, I'm uh, A-okay with it. It's a good... Tea's delicious, it's man. It's a good life. Tea's delicious. Kelly was saying we should go to one of those tea houses for a terror blog. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, that'd be yeah. cool, dude. That'd be cool. I'm gonna chop some wood. I'm, a, chop I'm it gonna up. chop some wood. I'm gonna, I'm gonna chop some wood. 
But yeah, yeah. no, it's been ni- it has been nice. Uh, nice been t- drinking coffee and recording again. I don't know. It's got it's nice to have a little pass a little, a little coffee. Up. Is there anything but forges in your cup? The uh, <laughs> this is totally off topic, but yeah. you know what's really. I went to a rock and roll show last night. Okay. I went to Angel Olsen. Nice. And there is this, like, older gentleman. I don't want to, like, say, like, oh, fuck, now I have to do this all over Don't move. Again. Don't move. Um, but there was this older guy, and he had, he got on looking at his cell phone every, like, five minutes, and it had, he had a screen on, like, the brightest screen. Okay. And during the first band, there was only two bands that played. But during the first band, ah! <laughs> Berry the fucking good. power tree. I think if you throw a fish into that pond during the daytime, you get a berry. Oh, really? Yeah. Have you fished yet? Have nope. we fished yet? No. Nope. We should do that tomorrow if we have time. If to we have time. Yeah. The uh, we're harvesting wood because I know that I'm going to need it. He's gonna he's gonna want to need it. Need to expand my house. The uh, that's awesome. I got another power berry. Are you kidding me? That's so rad. I don't you think I've gotten three that. power berries. This soon into the game ever? Oh really? Yeah. Oh nice, dude. Yeah, this will be fun. We'll get all of them. Um. But he was doing it. But then also, like for some reason, like he kept on looking at his phone every five minutes during the while the other band was playing. Yeah. Which is like, uh, be like, be respectful. Yeah, yeah, or absolutely. turn your screen brightness down. It was like blinding. Yeah, me. you don't need to have daylight screen on. He was an older guy, and then he like I he was on Facebook like writing this huge rant about like. Apparently, Seattle is so passive aggressive that somebody irked him at the show. I don't know what it was, but he was, he, I was like reading it, and then he was like kind of like bitching about how Seattle's so passive aggressive when he's doing the most passive aggressive thing instead of actually talking to the person about the issue. Writing a He's Facebook writing it on post. Facebook. How yeah. ridiculous is that? That's ridiculous. It's like, yeah. man, you are. And then he just, like, just kept on looking back. You know, it's like that Facebook thing, like, did anybody like this? I'm in the right. I know that people's got to like this. Oh, and they kept, he kept checking back. Yes. Yeah, and that's anybody. what I think it was. He kept on checking back. But it was like, man, Ugh. you were, you paid at Dude, least. I'm so glad I got rid of my Facebook. It's, uh, it was like 12, 12 bucks for the show advance, which it was worth every penny. Yeah. But still, twelve bucks for a show—that's a lot of money. Yeah. And so, like, you spent twelve bucks, probably fifteen at the door. I don't know if he bought a ticket in advance or not, but he did that. And then you're just gonna complain about it and be on your phone instead of when, the show. yeah, when that band was really pretty darn good. Like, what was he even writing? What, what were people being passive aggressive? I have about? no he idea. Was, I don't know what it was. to write this. But he was also like kind of like he was like a callus in the world around him because he he took off his his jacket and then thwapped me in the back of the head with his jacket and then he put his back on and thwapped me in the back of the head again. So oh, it was good. like it was okay. like, man, I just don't think that you understand or you realize anything that's going on around you. No, you're just a big ass. So you're just, yeah, so you're just oblivious <laughs> to everything. Um, I think I'm going to just go to bed. Are you sure? You can you can harvest stumps unless you want to do that more of that tomorrow. Well, we can do it right now. Because, like, you've got the hot springs up there, so you can basically harvest them forever. How, how much uh, wood do you think we need? Do you remember? You need a lot to get all of the extensions. You need to, like, max well, out your wood. I know, I but just with... Should I get enough wood for all of the extensions right now? Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. I mean, I think you can just get wood while we while we talk about some shit. And yeah. Then and then call it a Maybe call, call it, it a night, so. yeah. The, uh... Yeah, so I thought that that was really funny. It was, like, the extreme, like... The obvious, like... Oh, man. To the hot springs. <sighs> Vanity is such an interesting thing. It also is kind of like I, I, I accidentally Seattle froze somebody yesterday too. Oh, did you? Yeah, because you might like, want to explain the Seattle freeze to people who are not. So the Seattle. Seattle freeze is kind of like this thing to where there are people. People say that Seattleites will be nice to you, but they won't become friends with you, and so it's kind of this thing to where it's we're nice, but then we also don't want to be your friend. You know, that's like that's like the stigma, I think, right? Am I yeah. saying that correctly? Yeah. The uh <clears throat> So there's this really like nice girl who who had a drink in her hand and she was with her friend. You gotta jump in and out and of then, the thing a yeah. bunch. The uh she came up to me and she was asking, like, Oh hey, do you know this band which is Angel Olsen, which you guys should check out if you ha- haven't yet. She's a really awesome singer songwriter. 
Check it out. We'll put she a link a, in the description. She has a... Well, no. It's just Angel Olsen. You don't need to do that. She's right, big it's enough. It's already done. You can see it down she's there. She's big enough. The, uh... <laughs> but she's great, and her voice is phenomenal. And the lyrics that she has in her songs are very, uh... They strike a chord with me. So this girl was like, Oh, hey, do you know who this is? I don't even know who this is. And I'm like, Yeah, I've known him for a while. Or known her for a while. She's really great. Love her lyrics and her voice is amazing. And then she's like, are you from here? And I said, well, I moved here a couple of years ago. And then, like, the conversation kind of stalled to where I was like, I don't really know what to say. Right. Like, I have no... I don't know what to do with my hands. I don't know what to, to where to go from here. Right. Because you're you with came your, up to me. You, yeah, you're with <laughs> your friend. I, I'm actually in the middle of, like, emailing somebody, like emailing booking places for like shows yeah i was emailing somebody about playing at a place and so i was like in another world and then like i guess conversation just died and then she just walked away she (laughs) was like left well i mean because it it, like had reached like uh i was done with the conversation and i didn't know like where it was going to go necessarily and yeah. then she was also drinking, so I don't know how much she had to drink and whether that had any influence well, yeah, on it. Well, I also it. think that, like, because that, that has happened to me at work sometimes, you know, where, like, a customer comes up and just, like, wants to talk. Yeah, and, and then I'm, like, like, in the middle of work, and I so no I go idea. back to work. And I don't think, I think the Seattle Freeze is less of, like, a... Uh, oh, fuck. People, people shutting people out, and more of like a people around here don't really know how to carry on like a conversation. Yeah, I think it's just they we're just all sort of like start a inept. start a conversation and then just like wait yeah, and then <laughs> wait for something to happen. <laughs> and and but that's that, but that girl wasn't from here. That's the thing. And yeah. I don't like small talk. Or maybe really, that's just maybe is, that's just what people elsewhere do is that they just have sort of idle. I hate small I, talk. I, see, I don't think of Seattle as like a busy place, though. Not as like a, not like New York, where people are like busy and they don't want to talk to you, sort of thing. But like, but Seattle gets that reputation totally. Seattle does kind of get a reputation of like being like if you're not holding my interest, I guess I'll focus on something that yeah. does. Yeah, oh, fuck. come on, come on, just fucking work with me. All right, there we go. Just trying to get kind of funny, easy. but yeah, at work it's like, dude, I can't talk to you right now. Like, <coughs> well, I, I wasn't even at work. I was like, just, I'm, I'm helping. I, I I'm was, helping people. Like, I'm helping other customers. I just, with I, you in a moment. I feel like it's. Uh, I also going back to that relatability thing. I just don't know, and I guess that's kind of an explorative. Like, you should explore common interests in conversation. And that's what conversation is for. Yeah, but it's hard for me to initiate and say like, oh, I can identify with you on this. Right. Especially when it's like you don't even know what music's playing tonight, and so that would be like the one identifier of like right. You're at a musical show, you would and think so that be would like, be like, oh, we could talk about the, the band. thread that connects yeah. you, you know, connects connects to you. I just feel like uh, in some ways I'm so socially inept; it's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't know. I think that everyone's just doing their best, and I try to, and I try to. They can uh, do. You won't know, okay, but you don't get to say, like, oh, well, I'm trying to be sociable. You are fucking Mr. Sociable. No, I am, so but that's... So you shut the front door. But that's what I'm saying, like, I just... When you talk to somebody, they're doing they're doing their best as well, right? And so you can just have, like, whatever level of interaction that you can with that person, right? And then that's the social interaction you get. That's, that's why true. I'm sociable and I can talk to people, because, like, I'm comfortable matching other people's, like, social interaction level. I'm not. Do we want to talk a lot? Do we want to talk a little? How is this going to work? And so it makes it, like, easier for me to, to do that, but... Jeff know, introduces all, me to people by saying, <laughs> you'll know right away whether or not he likes you. You will, though. But I that's know. okay. That's not a bad thing. I think it's the, uh, uh, it's a nice it's a nice quality to have, but yeah, when you meet Roger, you'll know pretty much right away whether or not he uh, he'll like you. He'll like you. No, I just referred to myself in the third person. I wonder how much. <laughs> how un- I mean, you can. It's closed weekends and holidays, so you won't be able to check for at least another episode. But this might be a, a good place to call it call it quits. Yeah, that's. So why don't we head to bed here? Why don't you pick up your dog a couple more times? Seattle fr- froze somebody. Ugh. It happens, man. Yeah. That's the second time it's happened. Yeah. The, uh... It's real. But the Seattle Freeze, not necessarily intentional 
Yeah, if anybody feels the Seattle freeze while you're here, sometimes we're just preoccupied. It's me me who does it. (laughs) Sometimes we're just emailing people. I was on work email, (laughs) and I was trying to get stuff, like, I was trying to focus on that, and then then talk, and then you just walked away. Yeah. So, sorry. Sorry, everybody. Picking up my dog. Putting up my dog. Picking up my dog. Putting up my dog. Putting up my dog. Putting up my dog. Do you not get tired of that? No. You're like holding the all the way up. I know it's like Statue of Liberty situation right now. Above your head. My beanie in one hand. Beanie in one hand. My controller, controller as other. high as it can go in the other. Yep, that's the beauty of wireless. It is nice. It's I do the like technology. the technology. I can do whatever the fuck I want. Now true. it's behind my head. Oh shit! That didn't work. Mm-hmm.